in a typical local area network, we should really have only one server machine. That server machine is responsible for running the WAP server as well as sending and receiving uh, requests to all the other gates. So it's advised that that machine be uh, equipped with the best hardware specs available. So your best machine ought to be a silver machine. So in this screen, we're going to basically identify on the network which uh, type of machine this is, whether it is a server or a gate. Now gates cannot load events. So if I want to deploy this machine as a gate, I must first have the server populated with the data up and running already. Since I don't have that, I'm going to identify or delegate this machine as a server. Notice here we have a third option, which is a standalone server. Standalone servers are new in this version of Gate Solutions. It is basically a deployment that does not require a local area network or an internet connection. It allows you to actually, uh, it, and it doesn't actually need WAMP either. It allows you to populate your database, your built-in Air SQLite server with ticket data and allows you to validate using that built-in SQLite server. It's very new and it's very cool. But a typical deployment will be using the local area network, so I'm going to be demonstrating that this way. So I'm going to click server because, as I said before, we need to populate the database. When I click server, what happens is the application launches WAMP and asks and checks it for data. If there is no data, then you'll be brought to this screen.